good morning everyone it is the miniature painter here who are doing very very well on this wonderful day right an update on my perry miniatures foot knight and it's from this kit 1450 to 1500 and you get 38 miniatures and they're so simple to paint you can put and build uh paint they're so simple to build you can build them however you like you can have whatever arms i do recommend certain arms on certain bodies torsos but I like to do them differently because that's just me. Um, some I've got 12 nearly finished. I've just built another 12. I've still got another 12 to build. I'm working on the standard bear and King Richard separately. And sorry, hot. Yes, um, some have got um, the tabard on some have got the live um, a coat over the armor and some haven't the majority of them are all in armor and so i have been experimenting with a few down there so we'll turn the camera around and we shall have a look see you in a minute right folks hello um before we crack on i should talk to you about my nights these come the other day from Little Big Man Studios. Just got to find some card or foil or whatever to do them for my bill and bow. So yes, really, really pleased that these came. Oh, right, um, yes, let's have a talk about my knights. Uh, these are the first 12. They've got to be highlighted. I could leave it like that. It looks, it looks like a dirty armour, but... Really, really pleased. Like I said, I still got to do just there and there, and the belts and the leather work around there. But yeah, so far, like just these bits behind here, we're really, really pleased. <clears throat> Gone with red and the blue, and that's because they represent the Duke of Norfolk's foot knights. So it's just mainly the silver work I was working on today. While well, it's cooled down a lot. Like I said, these guys have highlights and all sorts. Yeah, so there's no one there finished. Really, really pleased. I think the one I like the most is probably this one. And he looks like he reminds me of Lord of the Rings for some reason. The pose. But yeah, the Knights of Minas Tirith. Yeah, really, really chuffed with the way all the posability and stuff. Um, I'll show you where is it. There's one of them there I've actually built, and to me, he's just hardcore. That's this guy. He's got a big old axe thing there, and he's got a sword as well. So he's ready to swing, and he's ready to chop off some Lancastrian heads. Let's put that one down there. I should just move the camera. And this is the next 12. Really, really pleased with the building these. And that's like I said, they're so so simple to build. You can build them however you like. So I have changed them up a little bit from the first 12 I built. So yeah. You got this guy here cheering him on, ready to point the way and raising his fist. This guy here has got two swords. Like he's defending a blow from someone there and ready to swing back at him. Yeah, really, really chuffed with these so far. <clears throat> Just move the camera back. There you go. Yes, I'm really, really pleased with the work I've put into these so far. And a few people, I was thinking the other day, I got halfway through base um, priming them and putting the metal on. We used gun metal from Vallejo, which is this I've used for the metal, and a non oil wash. I got halfway through the first six, and I was then starting on these. And then I realised, well, why didn't I just spray them with 
GW's lead belcher. That would have saved a lot of time and a lot of effort. All I would have had to have done then in with the skin work, so let's bring this guy up, is just blocked in, say, a white on the skin and then gone over with the wash and tanned flesh and wash. Because they're mainly, 95% of the, the foot knights are all armoured. But Justin being Justin likes to do things differently. Um, King Richard. Nowhere near done. I literally did the armour today and gave it a wash and I've got to do the crown yet. Saw the scabbard and I've been working on the, the library. Red and the blue. Copying the box art. But yeah. <clears throat> <clears throat> really really pleased with the way these are going um really happy with my progress i've made painting wise i'm trying to lay off using contrast i've gone back to the normal paints because i want to develop myself as a painter um it's been five minutes so far what will i be working on once i've got this lot done well next week i'm probably going to be start building where we put them? Oh, there they are my Victrix French Grenadiers. I shall start. I'm sorry. I shall start doing them next week. The week after that, there won't be a video for about three weeks, and that's because I'm going away for a week to recharge the batteries. But yes, thank you very much for all my latest subscribers. It's been five and a half minutes so far, maybe six minutes. I've waffled enough. I've done a gav and. Gav Booth, excellent painter. Go and visit him. I'll put a link to his channel down below. He loves a good ramble, and it's kind of wearing off on me as well. I do like to have a ramble now in videos. Uh, yeah, I hope we're all doing very well. I hope we're all surviving the heat and keeping cool, drinking plenty of water, or whatever liquid you fancy. So thank you very much for watching. It's been long enough now, so I've been a Minish Painter, and you guys have been awesome. Bye!